postponement of election in this county? Uh, I think this postponement has come to us as a surprise because there had been a lot of anxiety in the, in the nation, especially in this region. And we want to believe that um, when you postpone the election, you promote anxiety again. And again, the state of chaos and anarchy that had been precipitated in the whole exercise. It means there's going to be a repeat, even more than double, the impact of that anxiety. So we believe it's not the best idea. Uh, our take is that they should let it go. Yeah, and um, Ofola Chebukati should simply calm down, pick his boxes, and take them back where they belong. Maybe, uh, Bishop, we have seen uh, different injuries. Uh, over 20 people have sustained serious injuries uh, and casualties being dropped at the Jaramogi Ginga Odinga Teaching and Referral Hospital. Maybe as church leaders, what's your take on what people term as uh, police brutality here in Kisumu? It has been exceptional because what is happening in Kisumu, we don't hear it somewhere else other than in Kisumu or Nyanza region for that matter. Why? When there is protest, nationwide protest, they only capitalize on Nyanza, as if Nyanza are the only rebellious people. These are our congregations, these are our Christians, these are our people. So we minister to them. And we don't believe in this idea of profiling one specific community. Yeah, if it's the only way of dividing the position, and then I think they are fooling themselves. Maybe as a solution way forward to the future of Kisumu County, we can see business premises opening up. Uh, what's your take on um, looking forward as we go to the, to the new elections, which Chef Tebukati has called, and uh, afterwards the residents of Kisumu, what do we expect? First of all, they have to suspend the election in its entirety here. Let us live in peace. With or without Nyanza people or other opposition people you know, voting, be, uh, president Uhuru is still going to be declared the president. There should not be so much disparate about the votes here. Let us live in peace. We will respect the rule of law. And that is our take. Maybe going forward, uh, on the, right now after this you're going to visit the people who have been injured and the, and the fatalities that we have experienced here in Kisumu County. Maybe what are you telling to, to the police commander here in, in Kisumu County and the authorities here? What's your take as church leaders? The police commander must respect people's lives. Our lives here is as important as the lives of his own family. If he resorts to ordering the killing of our people, how about if someone else also orders the killing of his own family? I want to believe that he's a family man. And as a family man, he must have the proper taste of the value for life. And if his mission here is to resort to killing our people, I think he's in a wrong territory. Well, uh, Michelle, as you heard from uh, Bishop Professor David Goria here in Kisumu County, Kisumu County we are, they, they are calling for peace and harmony between the police officers and the anti-IEBC uh, demonstrators here in Kisumu. From us in Kisumu, my name is Usain.